Hello there, Bruce Woodburn, Cross Country Mortgage, WDBO Radio, and WFLA Radio. And these are the three big things you need to know. First thing you need to know is that the federal finance agency that uh, oversees the uh, GSE or Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac uh, has announced that they are going to give a reprieve up until December 31st for loans that went into forbearance after they were closed but not yet delivered to Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac. Now, that sounds like a pretty good idea that they're going to take on those transactions. But keep in mind, if you went into forbearance, it's never a good thing. You're going to hear that some people, uh, some lenders just may not report that as negative credit. It's not true. It's going to show as negative credit and it will affect you. If you have lost your job and you literally cannot make your payments, well, then we all understand that you can't make your payments and you might need to be able to uh, negotiate with your mortgage company to go into some type of a forbearance program. However, if you can make your payments, don't think you're taking advantage of a situation just because it sounds good. It's not good and it's going to you will pay dearly for it later. Just trust me on that one. Don't do it if you don't have to do it. I'm talking to clients every day that say, "Oh yeah, my mortgage company offered this and they're going to put the balance at the end of the loan." By the way, can you refinance me out of my 5% interest rate? No, you have to wait 12 months. And what are rates going to be in 12 months from now? Lord only knows. So first big thing you need to know is the uh, don't go into forbearance if you don't have to. Second big thing you need to know. Well, um, cookies and milk is back in action. So as you guys know, every year I have hosted a party at my home called Cookies and Milk with Santa Claus. Well, with the whole COVID thing going on, all the malls are not having Santa around or they're having him behind plexiglass. It's just, it, it actually tears me apart to see that kids are not going to be able to enjoy this uh, holiday season the way that we did growing up. So uh, I am going to um, make sure we set uh, all the precautions in motion but we are going to have cookies and milk with Santa Claus at my house. And that is going to be on December the 5th from 1 to 3.30. It is a come and go as you please. I will have a professional photographer there and you will be able to get your picture taken with Santa Claus. Yes, we'll take your temperature when you come in and we're going to hand sanitize everybody. Santa Claus is going to be in good shape, but it will be a safe place for you. That is a promise. And the third big thing you need to know is if you have a four in front of your interest rate and you currently have a mortgage, or if you're paying PMI, you call me now. Now is the time to call me. We are seeing some uh, disturbances in the market. It's very unsettling right now. It's still very attractive. Don't get me wrong, but we don't know what tomorrow brings. So call me if you have a four in front of your interest rate, if you are currently paying PMI or MIP, if you would like to convert from a 30 to a 15 year, or you're considering, considering consolidating your debt. That is, those are the three big things you need to know. Today is November the 20th, and um, please tune into my radio show on Saturdays, WDBO 580 from noon to 1, or WFLA AM 540 from 2 to 3 o'clock. I look forward to seeing you and hearing from you. And don't forget, those are the three big things you need to know. Have a great day. Have a wonderful Thanksgiving holiday. Merry Christmas to all of you.